All right, today we're gonna do one of the new gauntlets. Of course, let's just start with the world gauntlet and begin it with Nivelle. This level is pretty good. This got it's got a few annoying things. I don't particularly like the coin, but you know, it's not too bad. It's, it's just kind of weird, but it's it's pretty fun. Not besides that, it's, did I not just not hold? I mustn't have. Um, I mean, it's a six star, so it's not particularly difficult. It's mainly just going to be me failing the coin, probably, because the coin's whack. There's like a bit of a lot decent amount of off-screen things, which is kind of annoying. But, you know, it's whatever. I don't like how flashy this part is. It's very uncomfortable to look at. Like, it's just very flickery, which is not pleasant. Jump. Don't need to jump there. Jump. Hold. Jump. Jump. Go up. Hit that weight. Good. Spider, one, two, one, two, click, click, don't click, orbs, please don't be brain dead, that would be fantastic, I really like to just not be brain dead, you know, for once, I, oh, I love broken levels, I, <laughs> why bro, um, there we go, no you don't jump, actually brain dead, I am so brain dead, there's jump indicators. Do I did I decide to not jump at the jump indicators? Yes, I don't like this coin. Why did I decide to not jump at the jump indicators? Who knows? Wait. Thanks for the thanks for the S block in the wrong place, buddy. Why can't I just beat levels in it? Why can't I just not throw, man? Like, seriously. It's so annoying. Can I not be brain dead this time, please? Like, come on. Jump. Don't jump early. Thank you. Jump. G3 and, like, yeah, there we go. Wait, no. Where is it? That's it. Took way too long. But, I mean, it's a good level. Besides a few of the weird deaths. <laughs> like... <laughs> But whatever, quests- Yeah, I like, I need to collect quests again, because I need diamonds. I need diamonds, man, for the diamond shop. Yeah, that's a fun level. Look, that's too, way too many. And uh, now on to Great White North. This level is very easy. The end's not- The end I'm probably going to die to, because like, it's harder to read. The rest of the level's very sight-readable, and the end is very not sight-readable. So this is very short, as you can tell, we're already at 15%, which is nice. So even if I do die to the end, it won't take a decade for me to get back there. I like this level, this is very fun. Like, relaxing, nice, easy, no coins as well, which means I can just actually focus on playing the level. Like, I like getting coins, but I also like it when there aren't coins, because it means I can just play the level. Because a lot of the time, the coins are, like, annoying. Nice, mate. Good job. Like, well done. Good, good sight reading ability. I've never died to that in... In practice, I'm not sure why I died there now, but I did because brain death. I don't know. Like, do do I just have some kind of brain death when I play this game? I think I must do because what am I doing? Apparently, this level was impossible when 2.2 first came out, but it's not impossible now. It functions. It is funny though that the 2.2 physics changes made one of the gauntlets introduced in it impossible, at least temporarily. Like that is very amusing to me. Click. You don't click- like, I- I'm so- I- so- why? I don't- why am I so bad at sight reading, man? It's so annoying. Excuse me! Can I not be brain dead, please? 
like, oh, it's just so annoying that I'm just <laughs> so bad at doing easier levels in any reasonable amount of time. I should really start star grinding, especially with the amount of orbs needed in 2.2. Like, obviously, I'm going to return to the GDDP after a bit, like, probably after I finish all the new gauntlets, but I don't think there's anything else new introduced, unless by the time I finish these gauntlets, there's more new gauntlets introduced, but I guess I could go back to the GDDP and start Nine Circles levels as well. But like, I, th I feel like I should do some just like grind easier for five, six stars to get more stars, more orbs, more keys, all of that, because I need them. Oh, I need to open all the chests and buy all the icons. There's so many things. There's so much stuff that's being introduced now. It's just, I, I don't think the way, if I want to unlock everything, and I kind of do, the way I play the game isn't going to work, and there's that level done. Nice! That's, I, that is a very fun level. I like that. I do wish the last part was a bit easier to sight wise, they're just a thin sliver, that's kind of funny. I do wish the last part was slightly easier to sight read, but whatever. Uh, I like that. Uh, 31 attempts. Now on to Frostburn Peak. This level, it's got a boss fight, and I'm not the biggest fan of boss fights in general, but besides that, it's pretty fun. Can that work, please? Besides that, it's pretty fun. Um, you know, I mean, we're already halfway through the new gauntlet, which is pretty nice. I mean, it does make sense. This is one of the easier ones. Like, I'm pretty sure there's only one demon, and that's the last level. Maybe there's, maybe there's one more after this. Maybe the last two are demons, but, like, there aren't, there aren't as many demons as the last gauntlet I played, to be fair. So it makes sense that it'll be easier, doesn't it? Why'd I stop holding? That's kind of brain dead. This level probably, I do act actually expect- STOP! Please! I do actually expect to die more places, because as I say, it's about boss fight, and I don't like boss- Can I not be brain dead? I'm not the biggest fan of boss fights. But like, this isn't hard, I should stop being stupid, please. It's like, because I never beat any of these new gauntlet levels, and now I finally am. Dude, can I not get a big lag spike, please? Now I'm finally, because like so many other people beat these when they were first announced, but I didn't because I was like, well, they're going to be in the new gauntlet, so like, wh why would I beat them now if I'm just going to re-beat them again? I, I do know a lot of people actually do re-beat levels outside of gauntlets, but I've never been particularly bothered to do that. I don't particularly care about the extra stats, so it makes it kind of more annoying to count. Anyway, dash orbs, get to the build up. Hopefully I just don't die to the boss fight, that would be nice. You know, just beat the level quickly, but when have I ever done that, you know? When have I ever just, just not died when I could just die instead? Don't die to this ship. This ship is kind of strict. I don't know how strict, but I have actually died to it while trying to follow the arrows, so it's not particularly free. Great fly, UFO. This UFO is pretty alright. Two, hold, yeah, I think we're fine, actually. I didn't just die when I could have not died. Kind of nice. That was pretty good. Pretty good in the end, because I just didn't throw. So nice when you just don't throw, you know? Hey, getting more keys. I need more keys, because I need to open the chests. Uh, yeah, no, I like that. That's good. Now on to Planet X. I'm not exactly sure how I feel about this level. The beginning's all right, but I'm not the... Like, after about halfway, I don't know, it gets kind of more annoying and less sight readable, which is always which is always less enjoyable, because I like being able to sight read levels, because that means I get them done faster. Like, it's alright, uh, as a whole. I would skip the yellow orb, but to survive somehow. Get this mini cubes harder. Like, yeah, there we go. I, I died instantly. This is harder to read. Well, this section of the level is mostly fine until you get to the UFO. And then the UFO is kind of hard to read, but it's also not too bad. Just kind of stay in the middle. This wave I've never died to, so hopefully I won't die here now, because that would be annoying. You know, like there's no reason to die to something you've never died to before. Just kind of like, yep, yep. There we go, like it's so bad to read. I don't like that last UFO, it's very annoying. I mm, I do not like that mini cube. It's just so much harder to read than every other part.
thank you. Yes, kind of annoying very quickly because the beginning is just free. And it takes so much longer to get back to anywhere. Oh, it's alright overall though. And now onto the last level, which is Down Under. I didn't actually know this level was in this gauntlet. I've been I've always liked the look of this level because obviously it's the Australian entry and I am Australian. This level's cool. I've always, it always just also looks fun. I've I've always liked the look of this level. And I'm glad to actually do it. Again, I've I kind of wanted to do it, but then I was like, well, it's in the gauntlet, so I won't. This level is very cool though. The last coin is actually kind of somewhat you don't go in there, buddy. The last coin is somewhat difficult to get. Yeah, nah. I forgot. This level's not very sight readable. It's fine though, because I like it. <laughs> if I actually like the level, I don't care if it's sight readable. <laughs> I like, because, to be honest, most of the time, I don't particularly care for many of the Gauntlet levels, but I actually care for this level. You know, I'm going to actually enjoy it, even if it is learning. And the last, the coins, you get coins in the last part, and that gets the, like, actual coin. And they're cut, you have to hold there, buddy. Those coins are kind of hard to get, so, you know, I might die there. I mean, I, I probably won't die, I'd more probably just miss the coin and have to restart, which is going to be kind of annoying, but it should be fine. was not stupid. I do actually, I have actually done this to 100, so I should be fine. I, I shouldn't be... I shouldn't be, I was about to say I shouldn't be dying stupidly, and then I just forgot that I was a robot. How am I just forgetting what to do, bro? Like, what am I doing? This boss fight is very generous with his hitboxes. Like, you can be hit by some of the... You can go through some of the exclamation marks and be fine. Which is very nice. I like this part. I've always liked this yellow orb. This yellow orb's cool. Like, it's just... This, that's one of the best uses of multi-activate I've seen, to be honest. Which is funny, but like, I like it. I survived. I actually forgot what to do. There, uh, bang, wave, come on, don't throw, have to jump late there, otherwise you don't make that jump, so go down, yeah, I knew I died of that coin, like, I don't like the coin. I missed it, damn it. That, I died to the bubbles, damn it. Stop, please. Up, up, get that coin, get that coin, thank you. There we go. Took me long enough, jeez. That's a good level though, that's just, I really like it. Fun level, good level. Let's go, I like that. That took 75 attempts, and with that done, that is the world gauntlet done. So let's get the reward. We've got light, some light shards, let's go, some diamonds, and DMT, nice! That's a cool ball as well, I like that. So with that done, I'm going to say thank you all for watching. Please consider liking and subscribing, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.